Well, due to tonight's scheduled changes, we are unable to bring you Murder Rooms, but it will return to BBC One next Tuesday at 8.30. Until now, we've only touched the surface. Now on BBC One, the news with Peter Sissons. It's 10 o'clock. Terrorists attack the heart of America with catastrophic loss of life. Hijacked planes smash into and destroy New York's tallest buildings. Both towers of the World Trade Center collapse with thousands trapped. Another plane explodes on the Pentagon, mocking America's defensive might. In the streets, panic and the certainty that casualties are horrendous. Tonight, Britain imposes drastic security measures as Blair condemns the terrorist barbarism. Good evening. America came under attack today from international terrorists on a scale that made it more an act of war. The center of New York is still smoldering with America's two tallest buildings in ruins. Terrorists also struck with remarkable ease at the heart of America's defense, the Pentagon. Also in Washington, other government buildings, symbols of American power were emptied as the terror spread. Air traffic is paralyzed, coast to coast, all key installations are on high alert. And amid the nightmare, the only estimate of fatalities is that they could run into many thousands. <laughs>